So that was Looking the Other Way by Laura Roy. <laughs> I can't lie, it sounds good on the record, but you hear her sing it live in the studio. Like, mm. she's so nang. Like, though she just belts out notes, it's just crit. Sorry, nang is a UK slang word. Oh, it okay. means like really good. Oh. <laughs> okay. But you know what? It's weird that um, Torontonians yeah. and Londoners, we share a lot of slang. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of slang. Because we're both influenced by the Jamaican yeah, culture. Yeah, big Jamaican and community in yeah. Toronto. So we have a lot of similar culture. That's why when Drake yeah. comes out with all this stuff, we're like, yes! Yeah. So that's why he loves London so much. We're just like them, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Have you heard more life yet? Yeah. I was actually listening on the way here. Because I've been. Of it? It's fire, man. It's fire. <laughs> like, that's Drake. Would that's... you work with him? Would I work with him? It's a question. I would absolutely love to work with him. No, but real talk, I was saying the other day to um, some of my friends here, I, you know, I was saying, like, next Drake album, like, I'm you, telling you. I'm going to be on it. I'm going to be on it. You're going to be on it. That's on. good. Let them yeah. know. Yeah. Because it was, it's always good to put things in the universe, you know what I'm saying? Totally. Like, but... Uh, yeah, with Toronto artists, right? Toronto has like become a factory of musicians that's getting like pumped out of there from Drake to Tory Lanes to Daniel Caesar, Alicia Cara, who I yeah. love to death. Oh, yeah? I love Alicia so much. Nice. Alicia, if you're listening or if you're watching, I love you. <laughs> Like, I just want to let you know. If I meet her at some point soon, oh, I'll, put, I'll put in I a good word her. for you. Please. Like, don't worry. Oh, my God, yes. <laughs> so why, why do you think there's so much, like, talent just, like, getting pumped out of Toronto right now? I don't know, man. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Like, I think, I think that's just kind of how the universe works. It's like everyone's, everyone gets their time, you know? And mm. for whatever reason right now, I feel like this is really Toronto's and, and Canada's time, like. Exactly. Where's yeah. Justin Bieber from? He's from not, Canada. He's from, he's he's not from just Toronto, outside he's of from, Toronto. Yeah, he's from somewhere in Ontario. Okay. Yeah, see, it's just like loads of them. It's, it's crazy. The weekend. But of course, the weekend, Toronto. And all, party next door. Uh, yourself. Division, who I love. Division, yes. Matt, Ray Woods. Is, Jordan. Ray Woods, is Ray Woods from Canada? Ray Woods is from Canada. It's crazy. Yeah. You don't yeah. need to be stopped. There's a, whole, <laughs> there's a whole movement going on right now. I'm just yeah. happy that I'm kind of like... Maybe can jump on this wave. No, you know? no, you will do. So, yeah. what is your EP's name? So it's self-titled. It's self-titled. a self-titled EP that I put out uh, last summer, and I actually uh, wrote and recorded it in in Toronto. Why so, did Why did you make it self-titled and not call it anything fancy? I don't know. I just felt like um, you know I've I've put out a a project when I was younger, and I've always kind of put things out there. But this was like my first opportunity to kind of introduce myself I think yeah. to the scene officially and and yeah I just wanted to keep it simple and, and keep it self-titled you know yeah yeah I like the EP thanks my favorite song is of course <laughs> Plastic I already know <laughs> cause Plastic is just like it's real talk isn't it yeah like it's just real talk how I'm, you know what I'm gonna talk about it mm. would you like to introduce Plastic yeah uh, this is the last song on the project, which is on Spotify and Apple Music, so if people want to check it out, um, yeah, this one. Sometimes I bring out. You, you see me; I'm pretty like sweet and calm and, mm -hmm. and cool. But you know, sometimes I like to bring in a little bit of attitude in, in my writing. Aggression. So, yeah, a little bit. Maybe that's how I get it out. We were talking oh, about yeah, that. Oh yeah, you know? about it. We're saying how it's I like, couldn't imagine her angry in any yeah. way, and she's like, "No, I just be calm and stuff." <laughs> and I'm like, "So how how do you get it out?" She goes, "I don't." So I said, you're going to kill someone one day. You're going to hold it down. <laughs> and someone's going like, to step on your foot. And it's going to be like, the most minor thing ever. You're just going to murder them. No, no. But you're saying singing. Yeah. Well, now that we're anyway. talking about this, yeah. It's, I think that's definitely where I express some of that little aggression and anger. So it, it works. It works for me. This, so this is plastic. <laughs> 